This video will tell you how to install SIM card and cellular antenna and how to get internet access via cellular network. You can use a SIM card ejector tool or a paper clip to push the yellow button on the left panel of the slot. And then you will see the SIM card slot popping out directly. Put the SIM card onto the slot and then insert the slot back into the hole. As the router has two SIM card slots, you can insert two SIM cards for dual SIM strategy according to your needs. UrsaLink offers two types of cellular antennas for selection stubby antenna and magnet mount antenna. On the router, you can see two cellular antenna connectors, main connector and auxiliary connector. We suggest you install two antennas in order to receive a better signal. Pick off the cover caps, Here, we use Stubby antenna as example. Rotate the antenna into the antenna connector and place the router on a site with strong cellular signal. Connect the terminal block of power supply to matching connector to boot router. Let's look at the LED indicators on the front panel. If the power indicator is on, this means the router is powered on. Now we connect computer to Gigabyte Ethernet slot 1 port 1, which is the LAN port of UR75 router. If you can see the orange light of Gigabyte Ethernet slot 1 port 1 is blinking, this means the data is transmitting. If the green light is on, this means the port is operating at a maximum speed of 1000 megabyte per second. The default IP address of UrsaLink router is 192.168.1.1. To access UrsaLink router, the computer's IP address should be within the same network segment of the router. You can see the IP address of this computer is now on the network segment of 5. We need to change it to 1 to log in the web interface of UrsaLink router. Open a web browser. Enter the default IP address of router. Press Enter button. Fill in the default username and password. And then click Login. When you log in with the default username and password, you will be asked to change the password. Click Cancel if you want to modify a letter. To gain a cellular network connection, you need to configure access point name, which is called APM. Go to Network Interface Cellular. Fill in the values your carrier are using for APM, username, and password. You can ask your carrier or visit our website for them. Then click Save and Apply. There are several steps to check the cellular network status. First, check the front panel of UrsaLink router. There are three signal indicators. One light on means the signal is weak. Two lights on means the signal is normal. 
all lights on means the signal is great. Second, go to status, cellular. The network status shows connected. It means the router is connected to cellular network. Third, go to maintenance, tools. Use ping tool to check the cellular network connection. Or try to visit a website. The Google page is loaded. That means the router is connected to cellular network successfully. Thank you for watching. I hope lesson one won't be too difficult for you. If you have any questions or suggestions, please contact us. See you next time.